nothing went right for the Seminoles on offense, defense, or special teams as they fall to number 10 Louisville, 63-20. They got the momentum of the game and then we could never turn it back. And then right before half, uh, them getting that two minute drive and, and coming down. And then the second half, we never did get the momentum. They got the momentum, we could never change it. And that's why I say you, you play with fire when you let teams get ahead of you. And we knew that, but we felt like we weathered it until right there in the middle. Actually, it wasn't the beginning of the game, it was the middle of the second quarter on. Just wasn't capitalizing on them plays, you know, giving them stuff, you know, missed tackles. And, you know, just wasn't, just wasn't playing FSU football. I mean, honestly, I feel like all of the players, we taking it the hard way. I mean, we prepared for this game, but, you know, we just got to die through adversity and we're going to bounce back. We'll keep growing as a team. Some of our young guys got to, you know, got to grow up in some key situations on the ropes. A very good environment and a very good team. And uh, like I said, it was a very good football team. So we got to grow from it, get ready in South Florida. got a heck of a team. Get ready to get down there and play on the road again next week. The main thing, I just want us to stay together, you know, and just stick through this adversity that we're dealing with right now. Because, I mean, it's just one game. I mean, we can just we have a whole full season left. So just got to bounce back, like I said. For now, I'm not letting nothing get away. I, I know what it takes to win a national championship. I seen the older guys, you know, show me the ropes of one and one. And, you know, I can't be friends, you know. There's no, you know, off the field stuff going on. Like, you know, I can't be cool when it comes to, you know, being on the field. I got a demand you know, what's right and what to do as a national as a national championship team. And for now on, I'm, I'm giving a hundred percent. You know, I'm I'm a, I'm I'm gonna step up my my leadership skills. You know, I'm not letting nothing like if it's the smallest thing, I'm getting on it. Because I don't want to experience this ever again. You'll never see somebody out hustle, run to the ball, lead, outwork me from for now on ever. Florida State will have to bounce back in a hurry as they hit the road once again next week in Tampa to take on USF. That'll wrap up our coverage from Louisville, LaneHurtSeminoles.com.